In this short video, I will show you how to connect an attend to Telegram, how to receive the messages in an attend from Telegram, and to send the messages from an attend to Telegram to private groups. First of all, you need to go here and choose create credential. We'll search for Telegram, Telegram API. We choose it. And you can see that uh, there is a field access token which is required and the field base URL which is already filled in. The only thing we need is access token. We go to Telegram. So what you need to do, you need to uh, go to search and search for a specific bot called uh, Botfather. You can see it here with a blue check mark. You click on it uh, and you press start to start conversation. There is a comment which you're interested in. It's, a, it's called new bot. You click on new bot and it asks you to provide the name for the bot. Uh, the name can be not unique. Uh, you can uh, do whatever you want here. I will uh, write, it's gonna be NA10 first bot. That's gonna be the name of the bot. And now let's choose the username, which should be unique and which should finish with a bot like this or underscore bot. Let's write uh, unreasonable NA10 bot. You can see here the name of the bot and the link to the bot itself, and then access token. Access token is the thing which we actually need. So I will copy it to the clipboard. And first, by the way, let's just go uh, to the bot itself and let's activate it. We activate it by pressing start. We pressed it, we see, we can see that the bot appeared here among my chats, that's my bot. Let's go back to Telegram and let's pass, paste the access token here. We press save, everything is done. Now we'll get uh, the green field here connected connection tested successfully we close it and we can see that uh, there is a telegram account which is added to the credentials let's try it let's go to overview and uh, we'll create a new workflow in this workflow let's uh, add telegram and we will be first listening uh, to the messages coming uh, to the bot itself and we'll try to get these messages in an item so the trigger will be on message We'll make sure that our credentials are selected here. Trigger is on message. Let's test the step. And it is listening for the events happening uh, in the bot. Let's go back to Telegram. We're in the bot and let's write uh, hi bot. We're going back to, to Anitan and we can see that uh, the output is successful. The message uh, has been received by Anitan as well. And this is the message, hi bot. So everything is working. Now let's do another thing, which is very important. If you would like to send a message from an attend to Telegram, the best way to do it is to create a separate group for these purposes in Telegram so that all the messages which will be coming from this bot will be coming um, into this group. You can create different groups for, diff for different workflows and it's actually very flexible. I will just show you how to do it and then you'll be able to multiply uh, the groups for various purposes and workflows. So to do it, first of all, uh, let's go back to Telegram. So let's create a group. We will not add anybody into the group on the first stage. Uh, let's name the group test group and then we will not be adding any mem members. We're just creating it. We can see that the group appears here. The next thing you should do, you should actually add this bot to the group so that uh, we can will be able to send the messages from any using this bot into this group. To do it, we just first of all, let's go to the bot itself. Uh, click on the name of the bot and let's copy its username. Just copy it here, go back to the group, click on the name of the group, add this bot, and now the bot is the member of this group. Now let's go back to in NA10, we'll delete this node, and I would like to send a message from NA10 to this group. How to do it? Let's add Telegram. And here we'll not be triggering, but we actually will be sending the message. That's why let's search for message. And uh, we are finding it here, send a text message. Once I press it, I can see that I'm sending, I will be sending the message with my Telegram account. So with this bot connected, uh, it's gonna be, there's gonna be some text, let's say uh, hi to the group from an attend. And we'll need to provide the only thing uh, missing is chat ID, chat ID of this group. In Telegram, each group has its unique chat ID and each user has its ID as well. To find the chat ID of this group, uh, there are different ways. Uh, the way which I'm using, I'm doing the following. I will need to search for the bot, which is called uh, my ID bot, my ID bot. This is the one in the blue at my ID bot. And I will start conversation with this bot. 
Now, uh, what I will do next, uh, I will go back uh, to my chats. And in the chats, I go to the test group and I will add this bot. So I go here, I will add and start typing at my ID bot. Add the bot. So the bot is added. And now in the group itself, I can just write a message. I can start writing. Uh, I press slash and I write get group ID. Get group ID. And just like that, you are receiving a message, a response from ID bot with the ID of your group. You copy this ID. We go back to Telegram. We are pasting the chat ID. And let's test. Uh, test the message. So this message should be received in this group. We are testing the step. We see that everything is successful. You see the green checkbox here. We are coming back to the Telegram and seeing that there is the message received from NA10 first bot into the test group NA10. You can also see that there is a uh, attribution to NA10. You can, of course, leave it. I prefer uh, to remove it because otherwise uh, it becomes quite a mess. Uh, the message is just becoming quite long. To do it, you go back to NA10 and here you choose add field, append NA10 attribution and you deselect the appending. Let's test the step with another one. We go here and you can see that we received the message from this bot. Hi to the group from NA10, no NA10. So there is no NA10 attribution appears. I hope this video was useful. Telegram is a really important application for NA10 and you should know how to connect it and how to use it with private groups. Thank you for watching. Uh, if you like the video and find it useful, uh, I would appreciate if you subscribe to the channel and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.